Your Excellency, Mr. Aqil Biltaji, the Mayor of Amman, honorable guests and parents, dear students, good evening. Good evening and welcome to the place where it all began. Welcome to the SAE. For today, we are celebrating the graduation of class 2016. The students sitting right here have worked day and night to be where they are right now. And yet, it's still the beginning. For Jordan and the world are waiting for its youth to stir it to the direction in which we shall grow stronger and more empowered. Your Excellency, ladies and gentlemen, please help me welcome Mr. Asim al Nache, Regional Managing Director for SAE. Mr. Asim, if you may. Marhaban, good evening all. Everyone can feel great positive vibe, great energy, celebration, love, and success. Nothing can feel better than celebrating your success with your beloved family and friends. You should all be proud and happy. With 54 campuses in 28 countries, SAE is the largest media institute in the world. And proudly, SAE Amman is actually one of the largest and most equipped campuses from all these international campuses. And one of few who actually have the prestigious status of being a Middlesex University degree center, which means following the standards of the higher education system in UK. Moreover, each curriculum for all of the three measures we're offering is actually supervised by a committee of experts in their fields, all aiming to give you the most elite education anyone in the film, animation, or audio industries can ever get. At SAE Amman, we have over 15 nationalities from all over the world. We have an international faculty as well, all coming from different backgrounds, different nationalities, different races, different ages, even different religions. But we all gather and unite around the love and passion to create and the love and passion to make a change. At SAE Institute, you actually learn the art of storytelling, the art of telling stories of people. You also learn how to master your audiences, how to fully understand them and learn how to engage with them. Storytelling has actually started long, long ago, thousands of years ago, when cavemen actually drew on the caves, the stories of epic battles, what they've done, how they lived, and the hunting they've done. Storytelling never ended and will never stop. Our students, don't ever underestimate yourselves because with the use of technology, you can actually reach millions of people from all around the world. One of our recent graduates actually have a YouTube channel that have over 60 million views and half million subscribers. That's something that we never imagined can happen from a very young youth. So with great power also comes great responsibility as well. Our students, over the past few years, you have worked hard to acquire a large set of skills and knowledge. Now you are a world-class elite creative professionals. Now you have a lifetime to master what you've actually learned all over the years. You have the chance to create and live your own story. I wish you all all the best and congratulate you, your family, and your friends on your great achievement. Thank you all. Thank you, Mr. Asim. Ladies and gentlemen, as we all know, all of our graduates must have a lot to say about their experience and about all of their feelings and emotions. But unfortunately, due to the lack of time, we have only two students who will be presenting us with their graduating speech. We will be starting with Lean Dimashqiyeh. I would like to welcome His Excellency, Akil Biltaji, and honored guests and families that are always supporting us. Thank you so much. Dear colleagues, faculty members, ladies and gentlemen, I would like to take this opportunity to thank SAE 
and my colleagues for giving me the privilege of addressing you all this evening and for an incredible three-year journey that has had a profound impact on me, both as a filmmaker and as an individual. When I first joined SAE, all I had was passion. Thanks to guidance of the fine professors at this progressive institution, my colleagues and I were able to effectively harness our passion and to learn the tools and guidelines necessary to translate our vision into reality. All of us here are leaving SAE feeling empowered, having not only been taught the technical aspects of our respective crafts, but also nurtured as budding artists and encouraged to make our individual marks within our creative fields. Our journey at SAE was not always an easy one, as all my uh, colleagues are well aware. Filmmaking, after all, is about condensing life with all its complexities, experiences, emotions, and sensations. All with the hope of allowing those who experience our work to gain access to our thoughts and emotions that were previously inaccessible. For me, to learn the fundamentals of this craft has been a life-altering exper experience, to say the least. When my colleagues and I embarked on making our first major project, The Birds in the Camp, our first instinct was to challenge ourselves, to approach a serious subject and hopefully say something that is worth saying. Our primary ob objective was to help shed light on the plight of refugees, particularly in lost ger generations of children. We wanted to provide a realistic context that communicated the reality of the characters while still avoiding excessive sensationalism and stereotyping. Throughout the process, I had many doubts and was haunted by the prospect of failure. We all go through that, of course. But it was more than a vindiction for me to receive the positive feedback from my peers and professors. And I consider it a privilege that the people whose vision and talent I have come to admire found some value in my work. Thank you. I'm going to start with a quote from Banksy. Banksy once said, film is incredibly democratic and accessible. It's probably the best option if you want to change the world, not only decorate it. His words constantly echo through my mind, particularly as I prepare to embark on my own journey as a professional filmmaker. This is precisely what I want to do with my craft, to help change lives for the better and to make my own a mark on society that is constantly evolving. This is also what I encourage you all to do, to be brave in your creativity and to make waves wherever you go. I know for a fact that there is an incredible potential within these walls, within each and every one of you. A potential that is earning to be realized for the betterment of mankind. All I can do at this point is to congratulate you on completing the first chapter in your careers as filmmakers, animators, and audio engineers, and to wish you the best of luck in your future Congratulations are also well deserved by the many parents, family members, and friends whose love and support have allowed us all to reach this important milestone. Thank you so much. Ladies and gentlemen, now that was Lian Dimashqiya. Thank you, Lian. What a speech, yeah? Next up, I'd like to kindly ask Robert Aboud to approach the podium for a speech. I'm Robert Aboud, and I would like to welcome you on, all on behalf of my colleagues, graduates of 2016. It is a great privilege for us to have here with us His Excellency Mr. Akrab Al Taji, the Mayor of Amman, and Mr. Asim Al Natche, Regional Managing Director of SAE. Also, our dear faculty members and alumni who have inspired us and supported us throughout our studies at SAE. A warm welcome to our proud parents family and friends who have supported us throughout our academic years and helped us in realizing our dreams. It seems like it was all yesterday when as a child I was obsessed with movies. I wanted to live in a universe where Jurassic Park was a real life. I had a dream, but something was missing. When I was still at school, I visited SAE and found what I was looking for. It was a dream come true. We are one family in SAE. Finally, I found people with the same mentality who were driven with the same passion and enthusiasm. It was finally finding our true calling. Creativity was the name of the game, and that is what 
I found in SAE. Dear parents, I'm sure you are always wondering what on earth have we been doing in the past few years? Well, given this short time, I can't answer that now. But let me assure you that your children were in good hands. We overdosed on caffeine to keep up with the crazy deadlines, which was always a great disaster. It was very hard work with very long hours. And because of our passion for this industry, we found ourselves staying at SAE from 9 a.m. till 9 p.m., as well as many sleepless nights. But thankfully, we learned the importance of time management in our career, or maybe not yet. <laughs> the entire process was a struggle, and collaboration between audio, animation, and film students was very important and gave us the opportunity to learn from each other. On a lighter note, I am so proud to say that one of my short films done during my SAE studies found its way to Cannes Film Festival. It was a great experience. It was a great experience for me to get exposed to such a fantastic opportunity this early stage of my life. Well, my friends, this is the end of one beautiful experience and the beginning of a new one. We have worked so hard to reach this point in life that it almost feels like a dream is coming to an end. Look at all of us here, all the great talent right next to me. Let's give them a big round of applause, everyone, please. We are the new generation of creative people, and Jordan needs us. We need to make a change in Jordan's creative scene. We won't give up and leave Jordan, as our talent is very much needed here in Jordan. All we need is acceptance, encouragement, and to be given the chance to shine. And from the bottom of my heart, I wish you all the very, very best. Thank you, everyone, for a life-changing experience. We made it! Thank you, Robert. And yes, guys, you did make it. But again, it's still the beginning. The beginning of a prosperous life with which you shall help the world to grow to be a better one. Shadi Abu Jabir, we are still grieving that you're not here with us today. We all know that you're in a better place. Ladies and gentlemen, Your Excellency, Please help me wel welcome Mr. Muhannad Dasuki, the academic manager for SA Yaman. Good evening. Honored guests, proud parents, dearest colleagues, and future stars. I welcome you all to the 2016 graduation ceremony for SA Yaman. I stand here today filled with pride and joy to be part of the journey that this young group of talents uh, took to become a part of the engine that moves the media industry in Jordan and the region. We live in a challenging world filled with extreme competition. You have to work hard and channel every ounce of energy to leave your mark and become who you really want to become in this life. Especially if what you want to be does not align with the line of jobs that people choose normally. I remember when I first told my father that I wanted to study animation. He looked at me with a strange expression on his face, and after a long moment, he said, what should I tell the people? That my son makes Tom and Jerry cartoons? I did not argue much that day and went on to study computer science to fulfill his wishes. But after graduation, the voices inside my head got louder and louder. This is not what you want to do for the rest of your life, they said. So after three years of searching, researching, and hard practice, I became an animator and fulfilled my dream. I worked on lots of projects since then. Some are being shown on TV today. And I feel so much pride when my little daughter seeks for my name in the credits every time the show ends. I just want to give a big shout, a, a big shout out to all the parents who supported their children in becoming what they really want. Our beloved graduates, you have a tough journey in front of you. Equipped with determination, creativity, and skill versatility, you will overtake every hurdle with great ease. I'm full of confidence that most of you, if not all, will reach great, great heights in your careers and make your parents and children very proud. 
Good luck and see you around. And now is the moment that every single student would be waiting for the day they'd enter the university. And Mr. Asim Annachi, the regional manager director for SAE, to welcome, please welcome to the stage. Before that, first Mr. Aqil Biltaji would be more than happy if you can give us the word that you promised. Thank you very much. I've always wanted to be an animator, but uh, I could not make it. I didn't have the right grades uh, to be there. Uh, ladies and gentlemen, uh, good evening, and uh, it's such an honor to be with you tonight. Um, I have uh, been involved with this uh, institute for a, a long time, for a decade. And I remember the very first days when Ibrahim uh, Safadi and uh, Mr. Miller from Australia thought of the SAE. And uh, I came around to assist in, in those days. And I am so proud that uh, in my recent years, the last few years, I've been uh, instrumental to a certain extent on behalf of the city of Amman to help the institute build what you have, allow them some of the, the basement and other things, and uh, we overseen uh, some of the fees that they were supposed to pay, and I think Mr. Uh, Natche would uh, vouch for that. The reason was this is an institute that, that brought in talent that is needed uh, in our man. And Robert, I'm going to hold you to your word that you will stay in our man. And Lena, you were great there uh, in spite of the fact that you sat on the country. You're an actor uh, by nature, so uh, keep up the good work. I know that uh, the proud uh, uh, admin and uh, staff here uh, would like also to make sure that your students uh, stay around and but a very touching point that uh, last week I visited Shadi's uh, parents and I'm, I'm glad Diane is here and I was with them and we all agreed that on the 22nd of this month we will hold a not a memorial, but a gathering of friends, uh, asking each other and asking everybody to be more careful in driving, in having fun, in whatever you do as young boys and girls. But the memory of Shadi will always be with us because he was a born artist. He gave his heart out. Last week, his mother sang for me a beautiful recital, not about what Chaddy is all about, but what you, you young men and women, are all about as a beautiful thing in this life. So please, we need you around. One of my best friends and colleagues, uh, Khaled Irani, is amongst us as a father of one of the students, which shows you that Khaled could have sent his son to Berkeley, to Harvard, to any university, any school he, uh, Hassan would have wanted to go to, but instead he chose SAE. That is really a, a, a moment and a, a decision that I appreciate. And Khaled, there are so many Khalids here Everyone has done the same thing like you have. We are proud of you. Congratulations, and God bless you all. Mr. Aqib Taji, thank you so much, Your Excellency. Mr. Asim and Nachi, please welcome on stage. And it's the moment that the graduates have been waiting for. And now, it's time to announce the names of the graduates. We'll start with the first name. Shadi Abu Jabir. May his soul rest in peace. And the name of him. We'll start with the name of his sister. Mohamed Ali Shahid. May his soul rest in peace. 
Nathalie Suleiman Saba. Maher Tonko. Al-Walid Khalid Al-Dhahabi. Sama Amjad Bitawi. Samir Zakaria Batikhi. Mohanad Mahmoud Abu Qtaish. Luna Lias Chara. Malik Suhail Zghayar. لؤي نضال حسن نجود محمود أبو حويج صلاح الدين علي سالم نذير نادر الموج لين عماد دمشقية مجد غياب الشنواني عبد الله عمار حمود مجد ناهي مناع مناف خالد زند ايراني شامل ادي بينو لوي أنور طنوس روبرت يوسف عبود صقر جورج النبر يارا توفيق الزنانيري عميد عرفان شرايحة طارق عصام أبو عيشة إرهان علي قصاب باشي رضوان عبد المجيد شلبي محمد أحمد لضمور داليا جان زعتري سليم عبد الله سلامه كريم مصطفى الطاهر زيد علي الحلو وليد الهدى الترهي شكرا لطلابنا Your Excellency You were there since the beginning since the opening of the SAE and you were kind enough to be here with us please faddal bi salam al-dira' la hadratak thank you your excellency mr aqil biltaji mayor of amman mr asim nachi regional managing director for SAE i would like to kindly ask all of our graduates to come to the main stage please after the picture with mr aqil Graduates, please all come to the stage. It's because of all of the hard work you've done, you are finally here. And it's because moments like these, we shall live. They say the university is just the first step. And from this first step, you shall grow stronger and bigger. And don't forget, giving back to the community that you've came from is what makes you a greater person. And now is the cool part. 
congratulations, class of 2016. You may throw your hat. Congratulations and celebrations when I tell everyone that you're in love with me. Congratulations and jubilations. I want the world to know I'm happy as can be. Who would believe that I could be happy and contented? I used to think that happiness hadn't been invented. But that was in the bad old days before I met you. When I let you walk into my heart Congratulations and celebrations When I tell everyone that you're in love with me وأكيد من دون وجودكم حوالين الخريجين ما بيكون السعادة هاي زي ما هي حاليا And the evening is still going to get better Ladies and gentlemen For now راح أقدم لكم فرقة Get an eye To enjoy the rest of your evening Have a wonderful one